champion and Goldberg. Goldberg! Thank God we have five minutes left in the show. You've been doing an awful lot of talking lately. Certainly more than we're used to hearing from you. A lot more than we'd like to hear from you. Which is uncharacteristic of you, because normally you let your actions do the talking. So I can't help but to wonder if perhaps you're overcompensated for something. Maybe it's because you realize that you're outmatched. Yeah. You thought that you could just come out here and be the Goldberg of old, kick your leg up in the air, stick your tongue out, yell and scream, tell Bobby he's next, jackhammer, spear, wrench, repeat. But when you locked eyes with the Almighty, you saw that it was going to be different this time. For the first time in your career, you've run down on a man who's more dangerous than you, more ferocious than you, more explosive than you, more dominant than you. Goldberg, you have run down on the almighty WWE Champion, Bobby Lashley. I gave you every opportunity to bow down and walk away and save yourself the embarrassment of what I can do to you. But you're too damn stubborn and hard-headed. So now you play by the house rules. And around here, the house always wins. And I know you want to have this proud SummerSlam moment. And I'm going to give you that moment. Because I'm going to leave you with just enough so that you can go and tell all your family and friends that you had the privilege of having your career finally ended by the almighty WWE champion. Because when you step in this ring right here, you step in the house of the Almighty. <laughs> Lastly, that's bullshit! <laughs> that was the weakest fear, bro. That's true, so we. And if that is your city this Saturday night, this show sucks. We're going to have a new WWE champion. Who can do that to Bobby Lashley and walk away? That man, Goldberg. The only statement Goldberg needed to make for his 15 year old son, Gage, by his side, is Goldberg on the verge of becoming WWE champion. Or is Goldberg finally on a collision? His destruction at the hands of the Almighty. Gentlemen, we've seen this show sucks. Enraged. Bobby Lashley can do this to leave him in rage. There's a doubt about it. Or well, was this the advantage Goldberg needed to get under the champion's skin? Nice Goldberg came here to make a statement. And the statement was made at the expense of that man, the Almighty Bobby Lashley, who is now enraged. Well, the story remains. The same we find out for sure Saturday night, SummerSlam. The feud has been lit. We will see you in Sin City for Lashley versus Goldberg for the WWE Championship. This was one of the worst go home shows I've ever seen in my 11 years of watching professional wrestling. One of the worst. How, how am I supposed to be? Hype for SummerSlam when the bill has been terrible and they're, and the SmackDown side is going to carry the show. I'm only happy for the SmackDown side. The Raw side has been terrible. This show sucks. 
How was the show watchable for three hours? What was the what was the good thing on the show today? Other than Matt, other than Matt Riddle and Randy Warren coming together and challenging for the Raw Tag Team titles, what has been good about this show? This show is a copy and paste. So one of the worst go home shows that I've ever seen. Um, tomorrow's NXT go home show before the takeover. Let's see how NXT does tomorrow. Wednesday night, man. Everybody's everybody's favorite night of the week. We have AEW Dynamite. Great. It's gonna be it's gonna be a great show, man. That card is looking stacked, man. So hopefully it's a great show that night. Thursday, we have Impact Wrestling. Friday, we have um so, oh yeah, SmackDown, the go home show before SummerSlam. And AEW Rampage, the first dance from the unit from the United Center in Chicago, man. Cannot wait. The highly anticipated debut of CM Punk. Is it happening? Are the rumors true? Let's see what let's see what happens on Friday night, man. Saturday we have SummerSlam. Then Sunday we have NST Takeover. Is this potentially the last takeover? We don't know. Do we get a War Games takeover after this? We don't know. But anyway, guys, that's it for tonight, man. Thank you guys for joining with me. Thank you guys for hanging with me on this terrible Monday night. Uh, be sure to like, comment, subscribe. And I will see you guys tomorrow for NXT Go Home Show before takeover. I love y'all. Take care.